Hello students, welcome to my channel and you are watching the Ultimate English Teacher and Lecturer. So today we will discuss about the some extra question answer of the story, The Portrait of a Lady, CBAC Class 10. In my previous video, I have discussed about the first five extra questions. So today we will uh, discuss from the question number six. Question number six, why was it hard for the author to believe that his grandmother was once young and pretty? Answer, she was quite an old lady. She had been old and wrinkled for more than two decades. It is said that once she had been young and pretty. Full stop. But it is hard to believe so. Question number 7. The narrator's grandmother looked like the winter landscape in the mountain. Comment. So you have to comment about this statement. Answer. The grandmother was always dressed in spotless white. Full stop. She had silvery hair. Full stop. Her white locks spread untidily over her pale and wrinkled face. Full stop. She looked like an expanse of pure white serenity. Full stop. The stretch of the snow over the mountains looks equally white and peaceful. Full stop. So her silvery looks and white dress made her look like the winter landscape in the mountains. Question number 8. How did the narrator and his grandmother become good friends? I am repeating the question again. How did the narrator and his grandmother become good friend again? Become good friends. Answer, during his childhood, the narrator stayed with his grandmother in the village. Full stop. She was his constant companion. Full stop. She looked after him. Full stop. She used to wake him up. Full stop. She got him ready for school in the morning. Full stop. She would give him breakfast. Full stop. She went to school with him. Full stop. Question number 9. Why could the grandmother not work straight? Thakurma keno shoja hoye hatte parten na? And another question. How would she move about the house? Athini barish humosto bariter mothe kemon bhabe ghure barate. The grandmother was short and fat. She was also slightly bent. She put one hand on her waist to support this two. She could not walk straight. She walked like a lame person. She limpered or hobbled about while moving. And she also used to roam around the house wearing white Cloth. Question number 10. Describe how the grandmother spent her time while the narrator sat inside the village school. Answer. The grandmother went to school with the narrator. The school was attached to the temple. The narrator would learn alphabets and morning prayers at school. The grandmother would sit inside the temple. There she would read holy books. Full stop. Thus she spent time before they came back together from the school. Here. 
the village school is referred ok students so subscribe the channel and push the bell icon we will get the more question answer about the portrait of the lady in my next video